Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name is Ken. Today's experiment is trying to cut a hole in a three by five inch index card and fit it over your body. So what we're going to do is show you the math behind it and how it is possible out of this small little card. So what you need for this experiment is an index card, right? I'm using a three by five. Um, it also can be or a seven and a half, uh, seven and a half by twelve and inch, uh, twelve and a half centimeters. Um, you, uh, pencil, scissors, and a ruler. And so that's what you need for the experiment. Check the descriptions as I have it listed for what you need. The first thing you're going to do is take your index card, right, um, and you're going to fold it in half right here. Uh, perfect like that and so you've got the index card like this and then you're just going to draw lines and make a maze on the one side of the index card so it ends up looking like this so you've got the card like this by folding it in half and what you want to do is make sure that each end um, has the end that's opened doesn't cut the line doesn't come all the way to the end the first line has to come short of the end of the index card and the last one here has to come short of the index card and so that's what you need from there and then from there what you're going to be doing is you're going to cut these on the lines you made for the index card so i will speed this up in just a second, but we're gonna keep switching back and forth and then we'll come to the end when I get it completely cut out. So you've cut out the index card now and there's one more step. So when you open it up, um, when you go to open up the index card, you'll see the ends. This is the bottom end down here. The top end, this one, the outside one, and the, this outside one, you are not going to cut. But all the ones in between, we're going to cut. So you start with the second one here, um, and you go through and cut. And you're gonna do all these all the way across um, here, all but the end ones. And I will come back when I get them all cut. So I've cut through all the middle ones, but these two end ones here. So when I unfold it, you'll see this end one sealed, but it keeps coming out like this, and it makes one big rectangle like this. So now what we're gonna do is test the science. Was I able to take the one index card, create one big loop, and be able to fit over my body? And we're gonna do that experiment next. All right. Uh, all right, so the moment of truth here. So I've got the index card all cut out. And so part of the trick, uh, of the, of the mathematical portion of it is we've cut it so we've enlarged the hole. But you're gonna wanna take one hand first, come up, then you're gonna get your other arm up, depending on your size, right? And then you're gonna go down. Sometimes it catches on the back of your shirt. That time it didn't. And I'm gonna go all the way down and bring it through and it went all the way through. And that's the how to cut a hole in an index card. Um, and you can see the description on the mathematical formula where if you multiply the centimeters from the width and the, the length, you're able to get a larger uh, uh, rectangle out of it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to click thumbs up and to subscribe. Uh, it does help my channel. Thanks for watching.